Mosh Pit, how's it going? It's Ferris here, back again, and I've got something special for you guys today. It is a guest narration on two battles. Double header across the sky, get them! Alright, so um, this first one is it was sent to me by Nick. It is Nick versus Tom, and uh, I guess let's get into it. So he has his, I whip my Zed in here, he's used this Mew forever, and uh, I'd expect this from Nick by now. And uh, he transforms into our canine, so we're just having a bunch of doggy style fun here and uh if you couldn't tell by now i have a tech stack going on because uh dense fire for overheat and then a uh, special swag for special attack but um that's aside from the point he brings in spike this dragon thick dragon yeah i don't remember this thing's name i'm really bad with remembering the uh the new pokemon names even though the game's been out you know like the rom has been out for over a year now so i'm just derping it really hard right now so he brings in a uh, clay doll and Nick gets the paralysis on him because uh, he just does that all the time. And he's probably going to bring in something that has substitute. Um, yeah, okay, so if this thing has substitute, I'm going to... No, okay, so Nick, Nick, my boy, he just he uses substitute on everything. So uh, that, was a, that was a pretty safe call, I guess, saying that something Nick has has substitute. Because he always uses substitute, no matter what the situation. And he encored, but it failed or something, I think. And so uh, Tom's going to withdraw... And bring in uh, Clifford, the big red dog. Except uh, this Clifford will fuck your shit. He's not very friendly. Like the uh, Clifford that we all knew and loved from our childhood. So um, he's going to go for extreme speed. Uh, which is an obvious choice just to break that sub. And uh, Nick is going to go for something really uh, shenanigan-like here. Or thunder. That works too. And he's going to kill our canine. Which I am sad about because I love our canine. So uh, yeah, it brings in the dentist. I... Don't get that nickname, but I feel like I should. So, or maybe it's just not a nickname that has a reference to it. It's just Tom being Tom. I don't know. But, um, uh, now what's happening? Oh, okay, he's bringing in a Scavalier. And Nick is just staying in here and thundering behind a sub because he can just do that because he's just, um, clocking in right now with this. Um, uh, God, I don't remember its name either. I can't remember any names of any of these things. So, uh, yeah, shouts to Fizzy Stardust right now, just putting that out there. So, um, yeah, he brings in uh, Ihor now, which uh, I'm pretty sure, yeah, this is like, I think Tom's used that nickname for Gardevoir for as long as I can remember. I'm pretty sure. Correct me if I'm wrong, but wow, Nick has had this thing in forever. He's just thundering everything nonstop. He's going to run out of thunders eventually. Well, he encored that turn, so uh, going for Psychic, and it's going to not kill that thing. Jesus, Nick, this is like... The longest you've ever kept one Pokemon in, I swear. So, um, brings back in, oh, finally he switches. He brings back in Mew. Guess he didn't want to lose that thing to, uh, Gardevoir. So, brings in Mew to resist that Psychic. Pretty smart move. And now Tom's going to withdraw, probably because he doesn't have anything to hit him with on the Gardevoir. And, uh, nice play by Nick, getting the trick off. So, let's see what he gets. He gets a Scarf on that Tangrowth, which, uh, uh, he's done that to me a few times, and I don't like it, so... And he transforms into the Tangrowth. Nice, I like it. So uh, he missed. What you doing? And um, the only reason I say that is because it was in the text tag, not because I'm copyright infringing, suck for Jessica or anything. So that was the end of the game. I guess Tom ran because he rage quit or something because Nick was just being too much of a shenaniganer. Shenaniganer? Yeah, new word, guys. So um, this game, second game, this is MBZ. He sent this to me. MBZ against... Oh, Nick, this is bound to be awesome. I can't wait for this. I haven't seen these games yet, by the way, in case I... Haven't mentioned that, but oh, I can't wait for this. So um, he brings in uh, he, they lead off with Heatran, Hitmon, Lee, and uh, MBC switches to his Ghost type, obviously to take that high jump kick. Oh, Nick, you took half from that, dude. Come on now. He goes for suck for punch. It doesn't work because MBC used Willowis, but he misses. What you doing? And um, uh, he switches out. So uh, he brings in a uh, Bisharp. See, I know that thing's name. All right, let's go. I'm like one for seventy nine now with naming a uh, new Pokemon. So. Uh, oh, he gets that sucker punch off, so down goes Hitmonlee. Sour about that, Nick. So, um, brings in a fucking Volbeat. Alright, Nick is, alright, of course he would have sub on it. When Nick brings in an obscure Pokemon like that, you know that some serious shit's about to go down. And, uh, what's he gonna do now? I'm excited to see this. He's just gonna substitute again. Oh, Nick, you're so predictable, man. Come on now. And he's just going for the, um, Iron Punch. Yeah, <laughs> Iron Punch. So, uh, yeah, because, um... Uh, yeah, I think MBZ told me to make that tech stack in my thing, or MBZ or some, Nick told me, someone told me to do that, and then Bisharp shit the bed, um, that was my idea, 
by the way. So I feel like I'm talking more about the tech stack than I am about the battle. But uh, anyway, uh, Alejandro is in here on Registeel. And the one Registeel I have in 5th Gen still has Explosion. I need to fix that. So uh, that just reminded me. So uh, that Bullet Seed or whatever that was didn't do shit to the Registeel, which is expected. And brings back in Blue Duke because... Uh, that was actually pretty smart, you know, get him in before rocks were set up so he can still do some heat rampage rapery all over his team. And he goes for the will o still misses. Jeez, MBZ with your will o wisp, you're just not not a good day, man. Not a good day for you. So uh, he substitutes again, of course, and uh, he goes for Shadow Ball just to break that sub. And uh, Nick's probably just stalling for burn because uh, only with MBZ versus Nick would you see a Volbeat sub stalling a drift blim so it will die to its burn induced by a flame orb so um yep that just shows how awesome these two are and uh he brings emaga oh cool it's like seeing it from the other side no, yeah oh, okay more substituting of course and he gets that motor drive boost from something or another um i think i don't know what move he used probably hidden power because i don't know if drift blim gets an electric move um other than hidden power oh yeah it goes for what up zeus so yeah that was um i think i made that thunder so yeah, that's it. Uh, he had Thunder, and he finally dies to burn because Nick's a faggot. He has to stall out MBZ to um, not get destroyed by Drift. Well, I'm not kidding, Nick. So, uh, more Thunders being thrown around now, except this time on MBZ. Uh, get your ass zapped, and he's going to uh, break the yeah break the sub. So there we go. Oh, that's a rock move. I thought that was like a grass move for a second because I I'm retarded and I can't see things. Um, so he's gonna hidden power. And it's going to kill it because it was on like 3 HP. So um, Nick once again has this freaking flying squirrel thing in here. And it's just, uh, it's killing things. And can't be fun for MBZ right now. Except he's going to tank this thunder like a boss because he trained his... Oh, he got the parahax. Are you kidding me? And his balloon popped. And he missed the fire. Oh my gosh. Oh, MBZ, I'm feeling for you, man. That was... Oh, and he missed some more stuff. And then he got paralyzed. So much hacks. This is ridiculous. Oh, okay, He's, he missed the. Did both of them take God, yeah, what the hell is going on here? Somebody hit something. Okay, good. Uh, Nick finally hit the. Actually, that's not good. I want MBZ to pull out with this. So, um, uh, just because he was getting hacked so much there initially, and then the hack sort of evened out to both of them just getting, like, railed from behind by hacks. Like, if hacks was a person, it would, yeah. So, um, he's finally sort of doing something to that, uh, e manga. Thing, except uh not really because it's still alive and uh he's gonna finally kill it yes thank you that thing just causes so much pain and misery to everybody nick i hope you know that so he brings in his um oh, i know this thing's name i know it i mm, i it's on tip of my tongue i can't remember uh, nom whatever i'll call it nom so uh he's gonna pk star storm and uh kill that Rotom with Draco Meteor. And this isn't looking good for MBZ right now. He better pull this out with Dancing Guy. Alright, fucking Pelop here. Do this. Come on, man. Let's wreck some shit. Alright, Pika. No, you can live this. I know you can. You're better than that, man. Oh, fuck you. You're useless. Alright, so, um... Uh, it's, it's, um... Uh, nice try, MBZ. But, uh, I guess Nick is just, uh... Nick is just Nick. So, yeah. The, I hope you guys enjoyed. Those were the two games that were sent to me. Guess narrating them. And... As you just saw. So... I hope you guys like this. Uh, if you did, make sure to go check out my channel because I upload videos of this nature a bunch. And um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Subscribe to the Mosh Pit and myself. And uh, go subscribe to Fizzy Stardust because I gave him a shout out earlier. So uh, anyone who's not subscribed to him, go do that. And I think that's pretty much it. All right. So thank you all very much for watching. And I will be seeing you again pretty soon. Peace.